Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're getting the Windows cannot access the specified device path or file error on your Windows computer. This could definitely be a frustrating issue, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it. So, we're going to just start by locating a file or folder that we're having the problem with. So let's say I go over to documents here, and let's say it's just this particular folder I'm having the problems reading or writing to. I'm going to right click on the folder, and then I'm going to left click on properties. You want to go ahead and left click on the security tab. And now underneath the group or user names, you want to click the name to see the permissions that you have. So if you do system, you can see what the permissions are down here, and it would apply for all of them as well. So you scroll down. So once you're on this security tab, you want to go down and left click on advanced. Now you want to left click on add right here. So left click on add. And now that we're here, you want to go ahead and left click on select a principal. Left click on advanced. Left click on find now. And then you want to go down until you get to everyone. Left click on that. Double click on it. Once you've done that, left click on OK here. You want to go underneath basic permissions here. You want to select full control. And then left click on OK. And then apply and OK. And now hopefully you'll be able to access the folder you're having the problems with. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.